Pierre sues Harry for libel after Duke accuses him of personal attacking Meg in court. It's freedom of speech. In a recent trial, Harry accused Piers Morgan of a terrible attack on his family, but he disagreed and said it was a journalist's right to freedom of speech. He thinks Harry is insulting him and decides to take the case to court. The Duke of Sussex accused Piers Morgan of subjecting him and his wife to a barrage of horrific personal attacks and intimidation. The Duke added that he felt physically sick at the thought of Mr. Morgan or his journalists allegedly listening to voicemails left by the late Diana, Princess of Wales. The Duke claimed that Mr. Morgan, formerly editor of the Daily Mirror, had embarked upon a personal vendetta against him and the Duchess in retaliation for these legal proceedings. He said, Unfortunately, as a consequence of me bringing my Mirror Group claim, both myself and my wife have been subjected to a barrage of horrific personal attacks and intimidation from Piers Morgan, who was the editor of the Daily Mirror between 1995 and 2004, presumably in retaliation and in hope that I will back down before being able to hold him properly accountable for his unlawful activity to towards both me and my mother during his editorship. A 55-page statement was released on Tuesday as he began giving evidence in his phone hacking case against Mirror Group newspapers. Prince Harry signaled out Piers Morgan in his witness statement as he blasted the journalist's conduct, saying, The thought of Piers Morgan and his band of journalists earwigging into my mother's private and sensitive messages in the same way as they have me, and then having giving her a nightmare time three months prior to her death in Paris, makes me feel physically sick and even more determined to hold these people responsible, including Mr. Morgan, accountable for their vile and entirely unjustified behavior. Harry continued, Unfortunately, as a consequence of me bringing my mirror group claim, both myself and my wife have been subjected to a barrage of horrific personal attacks and intimidation from Piers Morgan, who was the editor of the Daily Mirror between 1995 and 2004, presumably in retaliation and in the hope that I will back down, before being able to hold him properly accountable for his unlawful activity towards both me and my mother during his editorship. Morgan has always denied any involvement in or knowledge of phone hacking or any other illegal activity. In May, Morgan took a pop at the Duke of Sussex when asked if he would be issuing any apology to the royal. He said, quote, All I'm going to say is I'm not going to take lectures on privacy invasion from Prince Harry, somebody who has spent the last three years ruthlessly and cynically invading the royal family's privacy for vast commercial gain. So I suggest he gets out of court and apologizes to his family for the disgraceful invasion of privacy that he's been purporting. Obviously, Piers Morgan is guilty considering how much he's deflecting. Morgan continued, saying, I think Prince Harry should be apologizing for his disgraceful invasion of privacy to the royal family. In March of 2021, Piers Morgan left ITV's Good Morning Britain over a row regarding comments he made about Meghan Markle. ITV announced the decision after Ofcom said it was investigating his comments after receiving 41,000 complaints. Morgan said he didn't believe a word the Duchess of Sussex said regarding her mental health during her interview with Oprah Winfrey. An ITV spokesperson said following his departure, Following discussions with ITV, Piers Morgan has decided now is the time to leave Good Morning Britain. ITV has accepted his decision and has nothing further to add.